All right, you guys, this is the best new breakfast. Ryan made it up. So you put eggs, scrambled eggs, whatever you want, in a tortilla. Add Texas Pete hot sauce. Guys, I don't use hot sauce, but this just is just the best meal. Topped off with Delaney's the best. And she asked me if I wanted Chick-fil-A, and I said, you know, some hash browns would supplement my burrito very well. So that's what today's meal is. And then you just pop it on there like so, roll it up, and enjoy. Look at that meal! <laughs> Project for my trend forecasting class with some other girls. Yeah, it's 11.15. I've got some jazz music playing. I've got some of my mighty patches on so I don't touch my blemishes. <laughs> and yeah, I'm currently caffeinating. And then in 40 minutes at 12 o'clock, Brooke and I are recording the next episode of Gals on the Go podcast. That's our podcast. If you guys don't know, you should totally listen. We upload new podcasts every Wednesday. My voice is like going. <laughs> But yeah, I'm enjoying this. I've been doing this thing every morning where I um, drink my coffee, do my doing well daily journal, write what I'm grateful for, play some jazz. And then I actually go on YouTube and I search NYC cityscapes and it just plays constantly for like hours. And I feel like I'm in New York City, but I'm not. <laughs> so yeah, welcome back to another college week in my life, by the way. That's what we're doing. All right, coffee is done. Getting set up to record an episode of Gals on the Go podcast with Brooke. That sad moment when she doesn't reply. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> How Sorry, you doing? I had my headphones plugged in, so I didn't hear it ringing. Don't even worry about it. I actually have to plug in my headphones as well. Yes, okay, ready, stand by. Recording. One, two, three. Hello, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to Gals on the Go podcast. It's Danielle. Alrighty, so Brooke and I just finished recording. It was like an hour and 15 minute episode. It was really good. We just talked about just like how it's okay to not have a plan right now and just feelings and just how, I don't know. I think it was a really good, relatable, like coming into college as a freshman and like how it's so okay to like not have a ton of friends right away because of everything going on. I think it was like a really good and relatable episode even if you're like post-grad trying to find a job right now we kind of touched on all the topics and we have a pretty hefty intro as well so um yeah Delaney and I are gonna go walk over to that new little outdoor spot I found they actually closed the street in downtown Athens and put a ton of tables outside where you could like get food from any of the places downtown sit there do work whatever so I'm really looking forward to that it's a little bit overcast but she said it's not supposed to rain so I just have the same shirt on I was wearing earlier from Free People Movement. I just put on these sweat shorts from um, Revolve. <laughs> what was that? I'm gonna pop on a necklace just to feel something. But yeah, I'm just packing a little bag. We're gonna walk over and maybe find some lunch too. I don't really know. back from doing work a little bit ago and then I had a zoom meeting and now I'm about to head over to spin and get a good workout in um this is my set that I'm wearing today it's from um beyond yoga I think we done dinner tonight if you guys watched my last day in my life vlog I made this and so now me and Delaney are making the rest of the shave steak doing zucchini onions and then we're gonna add some broccoli with teriyaki sauce and I'm really excited also I'm trying out this kombucha it's called lupus kitchen kitchen booch it's a passion fruit flavor and it was brewed in um Atlanta so I thought that was kind of cool oh baby yum yum and the tom It's 
I am making my desk my bed right now. I just didn't feel like sitting at my desk because the window is just bringing in such beautiful sunlight. I've got my New York City cityscapes going, just doing my doing well daily journal, planning out the day, writing what I'm grateful for, all that. Um, I have a quiz at 9.35 and I'm going to take that. So I'm going to, I think I'm going to get dressed and like do the whole bit and then sit and take it. Yeah, good morning, happy Tuesday. Bachelorette airs tonight. <laughs> really excited. I have a lot of homework I wanna get done today. Nothing in the plans, literally just taking this quiz. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, just taking this quiz and then doing homework all day. So maybe Delaney and I will go somewhere again or we'll sit in our living room. Not really sure, I haven't even talked to her yet this morning, but good morning. Headed to go get a green smoothie, just finished my quiz. Feeling good about it. Smoothie time. Decided to do my class out here. Got my kale slam smoothie. Good stuff. Hello guys, not much to update here, but I just figured I would because it's been a couple hours since I vlogged. I was outside, took my class outside and got a green smoothie. That was really, really nice. Delaney came and joined for a little bit and then we walked back and now she's at class. And I'm here actually editing my video for tomorrow. I'm really excited. I did an outfit of the week because I used to love those. And I don't know, it's just one of the, I've just, like I've said, I've really gotten into styling lately. Um, I actually just found out that I got a position on the styling team for Strike Magazine. They just started here at UGA. You guys should check them out. They are awesome. Um, and I'm really, really excited to be a part of that amazing group. And yeah, I just found out. So. Yeah, shout out to Strike Magazine. I'm gonna be one of the styling assistants along with so many amazing people. And I think we're doing all of that next semester, but I really am looking forward to that. And it was just another cool way to get involved on campus. And I really love what they're all about. So I'm really looking forward to that. So I just found out about that actually. So there's an update. Oh, I also just got my mail-in ballot in the mail and I'm going to be filling that out and sending that out this week. Shout out um, PSA, you guys should definitely, definitely vote if you're over the age of 18 and you registered to vote, which I hope you did. It's a very, very important election and I am so excited to be able to use my vote as a citizen and I wanted to promote that for y'all as well. If Maybe if you forgot, go check your mail. If you requested the mail-in ballot, definitely, definitely go do it. Yeah, I'm getting hungry. I actually was wrong. I do have, I do have spin today at four. I, completely forgot it. it's just in my calendar but i'm really looking forward to that ended up making some trader joe's chicken fried rice because it's just easy <laughs> all right just watched an episode of emily in paris <laughs> wearing this set to Purvello today it is just this yellow outdoor voices set um and then you guys already know the shoes whoa Cooking some orzo we're gonna add some pesto gonna harvest verb tonight big stuff. Um, I just cut this up. I thought it'd be fun. We could pop the orzo in there with the pesto. It'll be so fun. I don't know if it's ready yet though. Okay guys, updates to come on if this is good, but it looks so yum. I literally feel like I'm making a hello fresh meal right now. This looks so good. We added the pesto, harvested some of the basil, pop that in there. Yay! Needless to say, you guys, this was a success. It was delicioso. All right, so dinner was amazing. And then Delaney and I sat on the balcony and chatted for a bit just about life and what we want to do next year. And I'm just like, God, it got deep, y'all. Um, I'm drinking a LaCroix because yum. And we're about to head over to our friend's house to watch The Bachelorette because our TV doesn't have ABC. I literally don't know why. So we're going to head there now to watch The Bachelorette. I'm so excited. I feel like it's been forever since um, there's been like a Bachelorette season. It's going to be the most dramatic season ever. I'm just kidding. But um, I'm excited for Claire, but I'm more excited for Tasha. So comment down below if you guys feel the same way. But um, it's going to be a good time. So. Yeah, this is the outfit. I'm literally wearing my slippers and my sweatpants and a sweatshirt. Let's go. Yay, bachelor time. Oh boy. How much I love my dog. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. 
Bachelorette was pretty good last night. It was obviously different, but it was fun to watch it. It's Wednesday morning. I love Wednesdays because we post a new podcast episode of Gals on the Go podcast. If you don't listen, what are you doing? This week we're talking about how just it's okay to not have a plan and how to, it's okay to not have it figured out. Being alone versus being lonely. How to kind of cope with that. Um, and we just talk about a ton of random things. Our Chipotle order. Just so many random things. Um, so yeah, this morning I'm having my coffee in bed. I did my gratitude. I did my doing well daily journal, all that. I just uploaded an Outfits of the Week video, which if you guys haven't seen, go check it out. I, I had a lot of fun filming that. Um, so yeah, I love Wednesdays because I just post new fun stuff. Today is kind of grind day. Um, I have something fun kind of planned for tonight that I can't wait to show you guys. But, um, for now, I'm going to be working on my textiles testing labs. I have, like, a class today, but this class I have, she doesn't, like, have us watch the Zoom. She just posts videos. So, but today's the day I usually make myself watch the lectures, if that makes sense. Um... We can, like, go face-to-face -face every two weeks if we want. Yeah, so today is grind day. I might get lunch with Ryan. I haven't seen him in a couple days. So, um, yeah, we might meet up for lunch or something. We've both just been busy. That's kind of the vibe for today. But, yeah, hello. So I just showered and had breakfast. And I don't know why I was just feeling it. I felt like getting dressed. It's, like, 66 degrees outside and it, like, is still and that's... 11:10. I mean, it'll get a little bit warmer, but that means it's gonna be like a chillier day. So, I don't know. I was just feeling it. I haven't had makeup on in a couple days. So yeah, I literally am just <laughs> gonna do homework. But I was just feeling it. Maybe I'll take like a fun Insta picture. I don't really know. I've just been into fashion lately. Yeah, I'll show you guys my outfit. Oh shoot, Ryan's calling me. One sec. Ryan calls me and he goes, "You ready for lunch?" I'm like, "It's 11 o'clock. No." <laughs> All right, here's the fit. I'm playing around with some more layering necklaces because I can't wear that necklace set every day, the one that I showed in my last Outfits of the Week video. So here's the little necklace set we got going on here. Um, this one is from Missouri. It's like the Virgo sign. It's like a long one. This is a lock necklace that I got from Cheeky Peach in Athens. And then this one I think might also be from, actually, yeah, I think it's from Missouri. So yeah, Missouri, Missouri, and Cheeky Peach in Athens. But you could probably find something like this legit on Amazon. This shirt is from Madewell. It's just like a classic white tee. It just goes. Then I pulled out my Spanx leggings. They're so comfortable. They're like the, the liquid leggings. I don't really know what they're called. Like the faux leather ones. And then I really just went off and put on some boots. I'm literally, I don't even know if I'm going anywhere to even do my homework at this point. I think I'm literally just going to do it in my kitchen. But that's what this is all about, right? Fun! Delaney just took some pictures for me. The goat. <laughs> Got some Chipotle. Very happy Ryan got the carne asada. If you listen to this week's episode of Gals on the Go, you would know. The it's my first time having it. First time having it? What do you think? Uh, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. All right, just got back from lunch. Popped on a jacket. It's cold in here and my slippers. And yeah, I guess I dress up for lunch at this point because I don't even feel like going anywhere to do my homework. I have a lot of labs to get done. So I'm just going to set up camp here. I haven't pulled out my Nespresso in a minute. And I do have soy milk, so I think I'm gonna make an iced latte and have a little second coffee of the day to power through my labs. It's 1.43 now. Yeah, I feel like it's been forever since I've done an espresso montage. <laughs> oh my God, that is so embarrassing. Okay, I missed. Oh, she is still pretty. Yay. Been an hour or so out here grinding, doing standard deviation for my textiles testing lab. This is my old graphing calculator from high school. It has like a barely there monogram sticker. Memories. All right, I finished two labs. Thank goodness. I am so sleepy again. Um, it's five o'clock. <sighs> my brain hurts. I had to stop. I have two more labs, so I'm just gonna do those tomorrow. I bought a couple of ginger shots the other day at Arden's Garden, and I think I'm gonna take one. I love tinder shots for so many reasons. One of them, they wake me up. I think Delaney's napping right now. So. This is it. It's got ginger root, lemon juice, pineapple juice, and cayenne pepper. Bottoms up. Wakes you up. 
Alrighty guys, so I just chilled for a little bit and changed because, let me help, have Delaney help me with this. Delaney! She just woke up from a nap, she's tired. Where are we going? The pumpkin patch, so naturally I had to dress like a pumpkin. <laughs> We, we're together we are a jack-o-lantern so yeah we're having a cute fall evening we're gonna go to the millage pumpkin patch because it's really cute and get some pumpkins and then carve them or paint I, no we're not painting i don't think we have paint we gotta go get the carving stuff yeah i was gonna paint because i'm just terrible at carving but i'm also bad at painting and we want pumpkin seeds because delaney introduced me to those last year so freaking good they're actually so tasty they literally are they so take good. two seconds to make too yeah so i'm very excited so we're gonna get all the seeds out and then maybe carve do you know what you're gonna carve i don't know maybe probably do something basic like in the book that comes with it ah uh, yes yes we have to go get a carving kit we did this last year and um, we're going with a couple of our friends so it'll be a nice little chill we're going to our friend's house too we're sitting in her like backyard back patio thing outside it's gonna She's be nice nice big, space. nice big space for pumpkin carving so yeah yay i'll show you guys my outfit really quick i also brought sweatpants in case i can't do everything in these so my shirt is from the shirt is either from pepper mayo or verge girl i can't remember one of those just like a black crop rib top which is the one okay okay i think it's from pepper mayo and then I have these jeans on from Princess Polly. I'll link them down below. I really like them. I like that cross thing. And then I'm wearing my platform Converse. My earrings are from Love AJ. And then my 1998 necklace that I got for my birthday last year. And yeah. Woo! We just got to the pumpkin patch. <laughs> Oh, sure. Delaney, you kind of match it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I found the one. Yay! Little haul, got mine, theirs. <laughs> Wait, my. Oh, then Delaney got a big one and a that big one. Big one and a little So cute. We got Zoe's kitchen for dinner. Chicken roll ups, so good. Spooky vibes. Wee! Time to carve. Upon further review, um, I took all the pumpkin seeds out and I will be painting because it took me ages just to get this off. So decided to paint. We're doing a Georgia logo because go dogs. All right, the reveal. <laughs> She's prepping it. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God, that's so cute. He's home. All right, you guys, I tried. I'm pretty happy with it. I mean, you can tell what it is. It does? Okay, yay. This is Delaney's. Hers is cutie too. All right, we got the squad out here. We got UGA, we got Delaney's cute face. And then this one, we thought we had tea light candles, but we can't find them, so. Here we are, where the magic happens. <laughs> it looks so gross. <laughs> I'm so excited. I remember them from last year. They're gonna be so tasty. We're gonna roast them or bake them or bake, mm. roast, whatever toast. you wanna. Just showered and put my PJs on, actually. I'll have them linked down below. I just recently got them from Revolve. Um, I just missed wearing PJ sets and these are like not too hot because I don't really like sleeping in like super long sleeve stuff unless it's like the winter. Um, but yeah, it makes me feel a little bit more put together at night. Um, the pumpkin seeds are in the oven and I'm gonna start this book tonight. I'm, I just took some melatonin actually. I think I'm gonna hit the hay early tonight, but I'm gonna read this. Emma Isaacs winging it. Um, Brooke told me she loved it. But guys, I'm kind of feeling as if <laughs> this vlog is already so long. And I know this is gonna be a college week in my life vlog, but I feel like I might end it right now. It's just, I feel like this is already so long and tomorrow, literally, I'm just finishing my other two labs. And then Friday, I'm going to spin. <laughs> And then probably just doing my other homework. So I think I'm going to end the vlog here right now. So it's like a college days of my life, whatever. But I'll be vlogging and stuff more. I love you guys. I have had so much fun vlogging for you guys again. Tonight was such a lovely night. Very fall vibes. Um, I hate how I keep saying vibes. I'm sorry. But I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed, subscribe for new videos. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.